Hey everybody, uh, it's been a long week and I totally forgot to include the part uh, about uh, removing the person as a user. So we, we kind of built that functionality out, but if you tested it, uh, you saw in, in part two, you saw that we didn't actually hit this icon uh, to remove the person. Um, if you do that, it does remove the person, but it doesn't add this plus icon back. So basically what we need to do is we need to find a way to delete the request that was made between these two users. And the way that we're going to do that is we're actually going to make this button a list. Um, and it sounds crazy, I know, but uh, that's kind of what's going to happen here is we're going to just click this and click make list. And this is going to be a list of requests. And the filter here is going to match uh, what we had for the other one. So we only want to see the ones where the request index contains both the logged in user's email and where it contains the uh, the current user's email, right? Um, so we only want to see those requests, all right? And there should only be one because uh, they'll only be able to create a, requ a request when this button is visible. Uh, and we have visibility rules controlling when it's visible. So uh, even though we don't really need to, I'm just going to put a maximum number of items here as one because we only want to view the requests that they share. Um, and then I'm also going to just reduce this a little bit to make it a little bit cleaner looking. And then if I clip, click inside this list, what we're going to do is we see that it's sometimes visible there. Uh, but what we're going to do here is add another action to delete the current request. Um, and what that's going to do is um, delete the request that these two share. Um, and because this icon is filtered based off of the count uh, of the records, you know, we're counting how many requests they have between them. Uh, it, it, it will be less than zero because we just deleted it. Therefore, this icon will show up again. So that's that. And then we, another thing, thank you guys for pointing this out, that I did not incorporate into this is a remove icon for this. Um, so let's go ahead and add that in too. Um, let's go ahead and add this. And this is very simple uh, as opposed to everything else. Um, we're just going to add you know, a remove request, and this is not going to do anything except for just uh, basically delete the current request as if it never happened. All right, and you can, um, you know, set up whatever you want there, like link back or whatever. But basically, that's what that's going to do is just it's just going to delete the entire request as if it never happened. Um, and the person will be able to request again, but uh, you know that's pretty standard. You'll see that on Instagram and lots of other places where if I delete a request, it doesn't alert the other person, and they can ask me again if they want to until I block them. So um, thank you for reminding me of that. Uh, that was a kind of a critical step that was missing, um, but let's just preview it just to make sure here, just to make sure that we get it right. And um, so it looks like Let's go ahead and create a request. I'm not sure who I'm logged in as, so let's go ahead and log in as somebody else. All right. And I've already actually got a request in the database. That's why these two are not, not fixed. But let's just say that we you know, wanted to log in as, or we wanted to ask him you know, to be our friend. Um, it, so it shows us pending there. Now let's log in as, as Patrick Ford here. I don't know who that crazy guy is, but uh, I think we should just do this. And there we go. We'll go to requests here. And we have the option to remove it there as well. And then let's just go ahead and hit accept. Uh, this should go away, hopefully, it's being very slow. <laughs> Maybe, except, here we go, being very slow. All right, and we should be able to see that here, so I'm now friends with Dude, and let's just click the remove icon and make sure that this icon then shows up again. It is being very slow for some reason. All right, so there we go. There's our icon again, and we can then go back and, and request you know Patrick Ford to be our friends. 
our friend. So that's it. Thank you for reminding me that that is a very critical step there. And um, yeah, I hope that answers your question there.